Hi, in this video we will be having a revision on how to create a game using Sprite Lab from code.org. Uh, as you know, we're having a quiz inshallah next week. 7A uh, will be on Wednesday, 7B will be on Tuesday. Uh, during the practical part of the quiz, you will be asked to create uh, a simple game. You will be given instructions um, uh, of the game, what are uh, characters to add or sprites to add, uh, the background, uh, the behaviors of the sprites, uh, the events you need to add and so on. Uh, step number one, to create uh, a sprite lab project from create here and select sprite lab from rename you will change uh, the project to be your name uh, dash quiz one okay change the untitled project to be my name fatma dash quiz one and click save now you renamed it the project with your name okay uh, by default he will create uh, a sprite here which will be uh, the rapid and it will be created in the middle and x equals 200 and y equals 200 remember the two the 20 and 20 are the x and y the same as math the x axis and the y axis okay i don't need that sprite so i'm gonna change it to an alien okay and remember in the quiz you will be uh, given which sprites you need to add i'm gonna add this one and i need to change its position to be here so from the sign here in the location i'm going to move it to be here and click now it's in possession uh, x equals 40 y equals 78 okay and um, it's yani, just rem remember what i'm explaining now is not what will come in the quiz in the quiz we're gonna have a different game but i'm just showing you what are the steps you need to follow to create any game on sprite lab well now i need to add another alien here so from sprites drag make new and place it here change this one and instead of that rabbit to be a green alien from the sign here in the location i'm going to click and place my alien here and i need uh, a third one which will be placed it here so from sprites again make new place it here and i'm gonna add the yellow one and again i need to change its location i'm gonna place it here uh, now it's time for changing the background the background will come from the world here okay just need more click we're having two options to set a background to a scene for example or to set a background to a color uh, i'm gonna drag a scene and it will should be placed it to be the first block after when run okay drag it here to be the first one after one run remember in programming what will be uh, at the back should has its um, uh, code at the beginning so we need to start with the background then the sprites from the drop down menu here we may change the background to any suitable location uh, i guess this one is okay so they are in the space now we're done with the background with adding our sprites later on if we need to add more sprites we can add whatever sprite we need as for the behaviors of the three sprites from behaviors here we're having two options sprite begins to and sprites uh, stops 
the final uh, action of the sprite I need sprite begins as they will start doing that action once we click run and start the game first of all we don't have the rapid so we're gonna uh, click the drop down menu to select the blue alien from here and again from behaviors I'm gonna drag any behavior for him which will be like Mm, spanning to the left okay and again I'm going to add another behavior for the green one we're gonna follow the same steps start sprite begins and from here I'm gonna select the green one here sorry I didn't click and from behaviors he will be driving with arrow key no it will be growing okay here and again I'm gonna add a third one for the last uh, sprite the yellow one again from behaviors he will begin to sprite begins to this one will be the yellow one and for the behavior it will be like running right okay so run okay so the two of them will be spanning and the one in the middle will be growing okay reset now it's time for adding some events to our game what are events events are user actions on the sprites such as clicking on a sprite for example pressing any of the up down right left arrow uh, so the sprite will be responding to uh, that pressing uh, for example one of the sprites is touching another one and so on from events here uh, I need the event when touches okay just drag it here and remember the block of the event will not be attached to the rest of code it's like a, um, a separate program scroll down I need the um, green um, alien which is growing when he's touching the blue one he will stop growing and start shrinking okay so from here I'm gonna select the green when he's touching the blue one what will happen uh, his behavior will stop okay He's already growing so I need him to stop growing so again select the green one who will stop growing from behaviors I'm gonna select growing so once we click run he will start growing as we said here a sprite begins growing when he's touching the blue one he will stop growing run okay now he's touching the blue one he will stop growing now i need him to start shrinking so again from behaviors select sorry select sprite begins okay we need to reset and from here i need to select again the green one and as for the behavior it will be shrinking okay run Okay, we're shrinking here okay drag and place it here run okay he will be growing 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 and then stop growing and then he will start shrinking uh, now I need to add like the, um, um, a different um, sprite to be placed it here like the muscle and apple uh, a rock um, uh, a monster 
any different uh, sprite when I click that sprite all behaviors will be stopping all of them will stop doing anything and I need to change the color of um, the two aliens home, uh, yellow with blue to a different color first of all we're going to add uh, our sprite so we're gonna scroll up from sprites make new sprite okay we're gonna place it here and from the drop down menu we're going to select uh, any suitable sprite we may add that bell or if you need to add any different uh, sprite which does not exist here click draw and from uh, new here click add and search for any suitable sprite I'm gonna add like Sun okay so I'm gonna search by Sun this one okay and back to code from the drop down menu here I'm gonna add the Sun and I need to change its place to be here okay then scroll down when we click the sun the blue one will stop doing any behavior the green one and the, the yellow one so from events when clicked drag okay we're going to place it here and when we click the sun not the rapid what will happen from behavior we're gonna drag stops everything what will stop the blue one will stop the blue alien from here and we need to add another one for the green and another one for the yellow so again from behaviors stop the green and again behaviors stops everything it will be for the yellow one okay click run they will start shrinking sorry growing uh, when we click on the sun everything will stop moving okay now we need to add another uh, sprite so they will be back to their original behavior okay so again from sprites uh, make new sprite place it here this time I'm gonna add a moon okay from draw new I'm gonna search for moon okay this is a moon okay this is somehow weird so we're gonna add like a star okay okay we're gonna add this one count and from the drop down menu we're going to add a star okay change its place so it will be displayed here okay scroll down actually all of our uh, behaviors uh, sprite begins sprite begins to grow sp yellow sprite begins to spanning all of them should start when we click on the star okay and after that 
uh, after the green one will be growing he will be touching the blue one and he will be shrinking again so we need to add uh, an event when we click the start everything will start moving and when we click the sun which we already have here everything will stop so i just moved it sprite begins away and i'm going to add event when clicked when what will be clicked when the store will be clicked those sprites will start moving okay i just want to add it here and then move those away to make our code organized it will be it will be working if we didn't move them down but just to keep our code organized okay so let's try run nothing will happen when we click the star okay they will start moving when we click the sun they will stop again click star they will start and then stop start stop okay uh, get ready for the quest by doing the same example with your hand try to imagine any different behaviors add your own sprites your own background your own events and try to have fun as much as you can thank you so much